Lay my way to the top. Boy, I'm going to be winning. So I got a new one and just got a prime too. It lights up if you can see it. Yeah, 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 you can see it. But yeah, I'm at the gas station. So I'm about to fill up obviously. So It's hard out here once I'm on, we close up for $4. But 320 Sometimes what it would be like to drive a Prius is this is getting old real quick. I'm a monster fan, but that summer edition is pretty good, but I can't do how small it is because it's like 349 and this is way much bigger for a whole dollar cheaper pretty much. All right, so I just got out of AutoZone and they only had the ceramic ones. So that's what I had to buy. But I also got some paint because the paint actually, believe it or not, if you use it correctly on the caliper, or not the caliper, the rotor, it'll help prolong your brakes and keep them from getting that rust look so I'm gonna do a little bit of that while I um while I um you know <laughs> I lost my train of thought um to help prolong them because they um they get rusty really easily because they are exposed to a lot of heat and rain which are two main contributors to rust so yeah We'll get done with it. Just a nice arcs. What is it? I forgot which one that is. But it's an RX6, I think. It's really nice though. Really nice. But of course I had to stop and get something help me get through the you know process. This flavor is so good though. Highly recommend it. This is coming from a monster drinker anyways. Of course, with my luck, it would start raining, but it's only a sprinkle, so I can still work, but I have no room on this side. On this side, I have a lot more room if I would. I can actually move some of this stuff out the way, but on that side, I can't move this whole deep freezer 
so I don't know what I'm gonna do on that side but I forgot to get brake clean so we're gonna have to improvise and use um, alcohol it still works pretty much the exact same so uh, it's not too bad of a situation but I will show you guys the brakes that I got they're not like any crazy super high pricey stop tech brakes they're just some um, economy replacement OEM type brakes for the rears so if I can get this open use my mom's keys that's what I should do So yeah, they're like basic brakes. And I'm just open them. That. So yeah, nothing crazy. They are um, vented though. That's one thing that I wanted to get were vented brakes. So that's one plus to getting the wrong brakes. But yeah, these were already open. I'm gonna take these out plastic as well. There we go. So we're gonna have to start by cleaning them off. Uh, I just got some alcohol, regular alcohol, and paper towels. Nothing serious. Just get some on there, I'm sure. The reason why you have to clean it is because they ship them with a grease that's um, all over it to help protect it from when it's being shipped, you know. Helps it stay, um, what's the word, maintained or preserved and stuff like that. So that it doesn't get rusty or whatever. And it'd probably be better if I had a microfiber towel. I'm pretty sure I have one somewhere around here. Alright, so I got some newspaper laid down and I'm going to go ahead and start spraying the caliper rotor on this mess up. So I got the second coat done. But yeah, uh, starting to look a little bit better. Uh, you want to wait about 15 minutes between each pass, and I'm only gonna do three passes because it's not, you know, that big of a deal to where I need like even coverage everywhere. It's more or less just preventative maintenance and or. Yeah, preventing this because I'm preventing it from happening in the future. So yeah, 
Um, I'm gonna do one more, and then we're gonna put them on. Hopefully, I have enough daylight because it's starting to rain, as you can see, and the sun is kind of going down. I waited a little bit too late, probably. I wanted to wait late enough to where it was not too hot, but I wasn't expecting rain, so we'll see how it goes. All right, so it's time for the last pass. Um, with the last pass, you want to try to get a heavier coat. Even though I said it doesn't matter, um, this is just for the best results, and it'll look a lot better than just going uh, small and short uh, passes. So I'll show you what I mean. It up a little bit. that I nick so just nothing crazy just even though it'll probably make it a little uneven it's still covered up uh, just a little uh, pet peeve I don't want any nicks and that looks like everything so now it's time for installation so as I was explaining uh, as you know, see all this rust and spots and stuff that is a normal thing that happens with any iron that gets wet as you guys know but painting it is a way to prevent it if you do it correctly so that's why I did it it's just little aesthetic mods nothing too fancy I just wanted to you know have some type of contrast with the wheels anyways because rust on silver doesn't really look good so let's get to it so I forgot my tool set at my dad's house so I figured I would try to use some wrenches and this happened so I'm gonna go clean this up but I got the wheel off and I have to get back there and get one of the bolts off but yeah that really hurt 